everyone, Lee Kettleston here. We're on the final episode of the OA Season 1, which is called Invisible Self. I am really stoked to find out how we're going to be uh, concluding uh, the first season as we branch into Season 2, which I will remind you all that uh, that will be uh, beginning after uh, a week after Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., uh, season six. So once it's like episode thirteen of season of season six of Agents of Shield, then the next week we'll be getting season two of the OA. But um, yeah, I'm really excited. I do have a feeling we're going to be uh, doing some dimension jumping uh, by the end of this, especially with um, how the the five that uh, OA is uh, is telling her story to uh they have well we saw them practice the movements in the last episode but um yeah they have uh been picking up bits and pieces w will we see the fifth movement in this episode as well because uh we know uh in the flashbacks we've gotten uh four which is all well and good and Rachel is still not there yet with her fifth movement. So are we going to find out why it's taking so long for the fifth movement to come about? There, there's so much intrigue coming into this episode. And I do believe we'll be at a certain point of concluding the backstory. Because there's been a lot of backstory into um, informing the five about how Priri has done this and how, and how the movements have come together. It's it's just been a fascinating story. And this story, uh, the OA, it just feels so, so good. And I absolutely um, love what we've gotten uh, throughout the show. So it's absolutely been an amazing, um, it's been an amazing journey so far, the OA season one. Can't wait to see what season two has to bring. But with that said, let's just see how this season concludes with Invisible Self. Extended reaction will be up on Patreon. Looking forward to this. Let's go. This is exactly what it looks like, Stan. I have oh, five man. people locked in my basement. You can get it off your chest in a deposition. I have to talk to you about Evelyn. You don't say my wife's name. Shoot him! What if I told you that I could cure ALS? I could free her from oh, prison. Oh no! Stand up. No, 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 no! I'm gonna cuff you. The thing, the thing is, if this works, is this guy gonna let him? Oh my god! I mean, I'm sure this is going to work because this is not how they escape, surely. What's going on? It's working. It's working. No, it was, it was just a, like a fluctuating power at a convenient time. Love the music. Starting to work. Help to Captain Angels. It will be very hard. It will be very painful. Wait. But you must stay alive to give this to them. Wait, is she the fifth? The white moth flew from her mouth. It's always a matter of will. Only a person of great determination can swim to another side. Great determination. Are I mean, ready? Homer's vastly determined. Oh, man. I need to do this. Jeez. No matter how painful. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna take this fifth movement in. Get away. You're a complete bastard, Hap. Don't touch him! Get away from him! We'd never, not once, touched. Yeah, this is their first time. Oh my god. Hap being the cock block, basically. Right. It's their first time touching. I just realized that as well. Holy shit. That's how 
she was lost. And that's how she lost Homer and Co. Oh my god, that was heartbreaking. Yeah. It's uh He's doing he's uh, doing decent. It all okay. Just uh, it's okay. I want him to end up for some reason. Just to continue his goodness, his good heart. I love it. For animals. I went seven years without touching someone else's skin. And then you touched Homer's. Do you want me to stop? They're finally being let in. But, but that doesn't change. It doesn't change the fact that he took her away. Which you but told he last was none the wiser and... It doesn't change any of that. It's this new perspective, isn't it? I forgot coffee. <laughs> oh, Nancy, why? You were worried I would be hurt by her choice of words? She disappeared. I think that's more concerning. And you thought that's what I would have on my mind? Oh. I'm able. Freaking, freaking hurt me with the emotions. I'm just thinking back to Yondu's uh, quote in Guardians of the Galaxy, because she's still, because uh, Abel's still a father at the end of the day. Disappearance is gonna hurt like a bitch. I could. Man. Hi. This is oh, heartbreaking. <laughs> oh, yo, yo. They're gonna. <laughs> they got their jackpot. Good on someone to record previous music. It is beautiful. But we need more. See the dislike ratios. Who's ass do I have to kick? <laughs> Death experiences. I might have hit the jackpot of angels. Home is it? Ah, yes. Yeah. Um. Um, well. That water is. It, it is infectious. It just, um, wasn't true. But was it? <sighs> hmm, now this is very, very intriguing. I, I would, I would have just thought, I would have just thought the books were like an obsession. They were planted there, weren't I swear to fucking God. No, her story is true. They were just planted there. That... I think it's that guy. That FBI guy. I swear to God. Because he was in the house. Why was he in the house? The scars are there. Unless season two is just... Oh! Season two is discovering the truth. Mmm... I love how that trust that uh, Abel's got. Love it. But she's strong, Puri. She gonna run to the school? Oh, sh oh whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, Lord! Oh, no! Come on! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 
I'm fucking scared now. Like, this is... Is this... Oh no, BBA is gonna get shot, isn't she? No. Steve. Oh. They're all bad. Nice. Nice. They're doing it. They're doing it. cafeteria person true MVP they're gonna travel oh that's kind of that bullet hole thing oh she got sh oh she actually got shot oh my god See, I thought she was just standing there and it was, like, s symbolic or something, but... Holy shit! Take me with you! They said it would shit. be... Invisible. Oh my god, wait, so she tr- oh my god, oh my- I honestly- <laughs> Okay, so, Prairie Dimension jumped, I feel, at the end of that episode, and the, um, next episode, uh, the next- the last shot we see of her, should I say, was her in that new dimension, um, yeah, that's my take of it. See, what was so funny is I completely um, blanked at the um, at Prairie standing at, at the window with the bullet. I thought that was just symbolic or something like that. Um, yeah, because I, I, I just wouldn't have imagined it. And then Prairie gets shot. So it's like, holy shit. Um, yeah. That was insane. There was a lot of twists that came out. Um, Nancy keeping the letter, which I I felt so bad for, like for Abel. Um, it was really, it was really, really emotional, and I and I really, really enjoyed um, what was going down and uh, Nancy's explanation. Yeah, um, we got full circle on the flashbacks or flashbacks or whatever um because we had that book scene where it was like bunch a bunch of books all uh, and that made um alfonso think that she fabricated like she fabricated some detail um because it's like it does seem like the um events did happen but she um well Here's the thing. She might have orchestrated it or they were fucking planted by the FBI guy. I, I swear it, it was, it's all to make her sound crazy and all of that. I have a feeling that FBI guy did, did pretty dirty and yeah, that's my two cents on it. I think everything she told legitimately happened. She had a connection with Homer, um, yeah, everything happened, and, um, yeah, Prairie's story is true in all of that, so, yeah, but, holy crap, I absolutely, in like, I thought the ending was so, so, so super, super weird, um, and I, I don't know, like, I'm trying to think, like, the gun person who came at the school, I don't know if that's in relation to Hap or something like that. Maybe. Um, who knows? Maybe Hap has failed to, like, 
dimension jumped and all of that because he's got the fifth movement and all of that and he said oh me and uh, uh, everyone will be in a different dimension because now we're uh, and y'all are now expendable um so yeah i don't know if hap hired some people to 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 take care of like any more potential um threats to him like he somehow knew i have no idea but um i was just thinking like when everyone was doing their movements um i was just thinking the the person was so bewildered uh, i don't know if he, i don't know if the person who was shooting uh, was so b- bewildered he didn't know what to do when they were all doing their movements or if it was just like unrealistic like would he shoot them anyways like um like as soon as they got up your instinct is to shoot on sight is uh probably i have no idea but it, i mean it it seemed to work priori is now i think in a different dimension but um yeah Ooh, the sonic trailer okay this is gonna be fun i know what to do uh next time uh well i'm after this should i say but um yeah it's honestly just been superb like um yeah that that's there's a lot of things that i need to check out on twitter sorry i'm I'm just getting oh okay um yeah I, i'm just getting so distracted but there's a lot to take in and a lot of oh well here's the thing though i have also another theory brewing up in my head that Priri has already dimension jumped, I feel. Um, like, the, like I think um, it all goes back earlier this season. Like, they couldn't find uh, much information. Maybe it's because Priri has already dimension uh, dimension jumped. And that's why they can't find many inf- uh, much information. Because it won't exist in this dimension. I, I have no idea. But, like, she's uh, done it before... Oh my god, I'm so interested to see how season two is going to go. Because, oh my god, that was just an insane ending. That was just totally, totally insane. Um, But yeah, it was really, really good. Like I said, it was great to see the... um, uh, It it was great to have Homer and and Prairie touch for the first time. But it would also be the last time, I guess. um, Until she hopefully encounters Homer... But I'm wondering if uh, Prairie saying to Homer at the end is something similar to Alfonso when he saw uh, Homer in the mirror. Um, and I'm wondering if that's the same thing. Uh, we d- we didn't get much intel on where Prairie was. She just said Homer uh, in a white space. So she- it could be a bathroom. Like, I-, I have no idea, but we'll just have to wait and see. Um, yeah, so... It was really, really great to see the fifth movement be revealed to be the sheriff's wife and not Rachel. So that's why they couldn't get the fifth movement because they have not encountered that person yet. Um, and God damn, I, I believe the sheriff was just going to, to turn a blind eye, basically, to all the imprison- uh, all the, those in prison. They were begging to be released, but he was waiting to see if Hap's word was genuine. So, yeah, um... Which it turned out to be very, very genuine. But it doesn't matter because Hap shot. So, yeah. Um, and that was my main worry when Hap was glancing over with the sheriff. Like, he's going to learn the fifth movement too. And they are trying to make sure that um, Hap doesn't learn. But there's not much you can do, really. And um, it uh, the flashbacks all came full circle when Hap left Priory um, on the abandoned road. Where she would in- inevitably lead herself back to Crestwood. So... Yeah, um, it was, it was really, really, um, great to end on that note, like the flashbacks. Um, yeah, I'm just perplexed with the ending because it's just like, like, there's so many theories going on in my head at the minute. It's like, ah, so yeah, um, I really, really loved that discovery though. Like, um, I thought that was a bit of a game changer when everyone uh, came up when uh prairie uh concluded her story um yeah alfonso also making things uh, well i wouldn't say making things bad to worse but that in the last episode we know that prairie's parents didn't get the full intel on everything and uh she's uh more trustful to 
um, Alfonso to Steve to everything about her story so they can learn the movements. But Priri didn't tell anything. But it's it's okay because Nancy got a bit of a taste of her own medicine. But it's poor Abel, if anything, because Abel is the one that was in the dark about the whole letter situation. Um, but it was Nancy who didn't tell Abel about the letter. And he was worried sick for, for seven years. And her... Um, uh, at least she was able to open up after the whole situation of them moving somewhere else. So, yeah, um, I really, really uh, appreciated the fact that um, it was not in a dramatic sense as well, because we saw in the last episode that OA tried to explain everything, but uh, Nancy was in a panic state and then she gave that slap, didn't she? So, yeah, but um, it was a nice, calm environment after everything, after the discovery in the house. So I really, really felt that scene was great. But also, uh, I, I just felt so bad for Abel because Nancy kept uh, that letter from him and he was worried sick. And, uh, like, he had more priority on um, being worried for someone who he considers her daughter to... Uh, the aspect that she's going to find uh, her real father. Like, that's that's that wouldn't be the worrying thing. The worrying thing is uh, her just darting off. So I just felt so bad for Abel um, in this episode. Uh, but it was really, really uh, great stuff to see. But the thing is, like, I'm trying to think back because they found the video of... Um, Prairie playing the violet when Hap confronted her in episode two. They found the video of there, so I don't know. I mean, it the events could play out similar. Yeah, so the, so maybe in this because we didn't see Hap approach Prairie, we just saw Prairie on the violin, so that could still happen in the other dimension. Like in another dimension, um, Prairie played the violin, Hap didn't confront her. Um, yeah. So, oh my god, this is so, 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 so eerie, isn't it? Like, um, I, like I said, I do think that, um, guy that Prairie went to with the FBI, I think he planted the whole thing. I think he planted the books. That's, that's my two cents on it. So, yeah, um, whilst, uh, the FBI, tr um, tries to get in their hands dirt. Yeah, I think they tried to, like, um, you know how you want to, um, like, keep some distance and all of that? I think they wanted to try and keep some distance from the, um, the, uh, five and all of that. So they could get more intel and all of that. I have no idea, but I think they were trying to get some distance, um, so they could get the upper hand uh, investigating Prairie's story and all of that, and hence why they planted the books there, so they could believe that Prairie orchestrated a story. So yeah, um, and then it was it was just it was just really really sad to see everyone um, kind of move on from that because they kind of accepted that oh so she just got ex excerpts of this and uh, made it her story um, and all of that. So yeah. Um, like, we saw BBA getting let go, um, and all the, um, like, everyone was, like, um, in their own individual groups and all of that again until the shooting happened, so, yeah, um, but, yeah, it was a really, really interesting finale. I absolutely enjoyed it, so... I can't wait to see how season two does open up because we I, I'm led to the assumption that Prairie has dimension jumped um, after getting shot. Like I said, I thought I thought that was just symbolic for some reason because um, like we didn't get to see her getting shot. So, yeah, but um, we saw the bullet hole and then next week I was like, oh, so silly me. But uh, yeah, that was a really, really interesting um, finale. Uh, there was some, um, there was some truths that came out. There was, there, there's theories going on all over the place in my head. So yeah, I really, really thought that was an interesting, uh, way to cap off season one. So yeah, but this show has just been absolutely insane and I have not stopped loving the journey and I can't wait to see what season two has on offer. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to end it there so I can get, uh, so, cause I've got a few more of the stuff to do, um, 
interesting finale. I absolutely enjoyed that. But yeah, I will see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. You can check my videos on the right. Or you can check the playlist to the OA if you've missed any episode reactions. You can also subscribe to my media feeds and channel if you want to. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Hope you guys take care and I will see you guys next time. Toodles!